Hey guys, it's Prince Rich with Rich Technology Group. And today I have a special video for you guys. We are going to talk about the top five Ring Central business features for 2024. But I decided come on down to an event and get with some guys from Ring Central themselves to do this with you guys. So first and foremost, my two guests, thank you so much for being here to speak with me and my audience. Would you please introduce yourself first and last name and let the audience know what you do at Ring Central? Absolutely. Hey everybody, my name is Pat right. I'm out of Denver, Colorado. I manage basically all of the national distributors um, in the country. And my goal is to get the information out to our consumers on how our products can enable their workforce. Their, you know, maybe it's a simple company, their pizza shop. Doesn't really matter how our technology is benefit to them and the communications that they need. Robert Fishkin, I'm out of North Carolina. I'm a channel manager with Rick Central. So I assist our partners who bring our solutions to market and uh, help them Get it to you. Okay, okay. Before we jump in, for those of you guys, the viewers watching, if you've been to our channel, you already know we talk about Ring Central a lot, and you know that not only have they won awards on our channel, but they've always been recognized as being one of the providers in the market, if not the provider in the market that has the most features. Fortunately and unfortunately for you guys today, the viewers, we're not going to go over all of those features because there ain't enough time in this video or enough space on this camera to do that. But we're going to highlight the top five. So starting with number one. Ring Central Push to Talk, also known as PTT. Tell the viewers what is it, what does it do, and what's the benefits of it? Well, first of all, I'd say get down with PTT, you know me. But at the end of the day, Push to Talk is a technology, it's not new. If you remember the old Nextel days when you'd bleep and you'd yep. sound like you were talking to the spaceship, that's what Push to Talk has become for the frontline workers. We use it in the field all of the time where if you were in Home Depot and you wanted everybody on because, you know, we needed to evacuate the store, you could actually just, you know, push the button and everybody would hear it and they would be able to do whatever they want to do. Have anything to add inside that Push to Talk? It's great in the warehouse scenario, it's great in healthcare. You just get a message out to someone really quickly. Um, so it comes in handy in a lot of different situations. Not to be confused with it, you know, uh, an emergency notification system, which we could also provide, but that's in another, you know, another saga that we can talk about. Way a future down the road. video. <laughs> yeah. Hey, folks, listen, at the end of the day, Ring Central is a behemoth, and we're very big and, and we're very concerned about the new breaking, cutting edge technology. In fact, Ring Central spent over a half a billion dollars, it's with a B, half a billion dollars in R&D. And then, you know, I mean, we have a lot of competitors here that didn't even make a half a billion dollars in revenue. Wow. So just kind of give you an idea of, of the, how deep we go into our innovation. This is, this is, uh, you know, I think Ring Central is, is a staple in the industry. Awesome. So coming in at feature number two of the top five Ring Central business features for 2024, Ring Central from Microsoft Teams. What is it? How does it work? What are the benefits of it? And also, if you can, give me some use cases. I am passionate about this conversation because Teams is difficult. Teams is something you either love it or hate it. I, I can remember back in the days if you were a Microsoft fan and you were a Bill Gates fan and you talked to a techie out there, they would look at you like you were the devil. They just didn't trust it. Microsoft is a staple in the environment, no question. A lot of us use it out there. And instead of us competing with it, we embraced it. And how we embraced it is we're able to put in the communication piece, that telephony piece, being able to be to never go down and have that uptime that we offer. Uh, right now, I believe six at six nines, right? We're getting up to six nines of uptime. And for you folks that are out there, that means we're up 99.999% of the time. That means you're let, we're down less than four minutes a year. Wow. Three and a half minutes a year. So it's, it's a big staple, but Teams is, a big, broad product, but things happen. And when Teams goes down, Microsoft's able to embed its dialer and you're able to talk to everybody and continue with the, the whatever conversation, whether it's video or audio or even texting, you're able to keep it up on the platform at all times. So we've become that secondary helper for Microsoft Teams. But a lot of times people end up using our product because the features are so rich in the communication side that they take advantage of that. It sounds like that you get a little bit of both with Bring Central. You not only get the more enhanced, more stable version of Teams, essentially, you also get access to the, as you put it, behemoth of other Ring Central features as That's well. That's right. Yeah. There's so many companies adopted Teams over COVID. You know, they was included in their E3 license and they were scrambling. How do we adjust to a different type of workforce? How do we go remote? And Teams made sense. And Teams is a good platform for collaboration. But there's a lot of things in Teams that just weren't quite there. So what our customers have been doing is they've been integrating Ring Central into the Teams environment, not having to retrain the actual users 
on how to communicate internally and externally. And the Ring Central embedded dialer adds a little Ring Central button that makes you phone calls. You can make uh, your texts and send faxes. You still use all the collaboration features of Gene. Jump to video? Um, yeah, jump to video. But you don't have to retrain your users. And it's really, like Pat was saying, it increases your stability, it gives you access to our analytics, which are second to none. You know, you get the full power of Ring Central. Embedded seamlessly into your team's life. When he talks about analytics, he's talking about from the minute you connected with us, if it's an omni channel environment, meaning maybe you came in through a text or a chat or an SMS, or maybe you came in on just a video or a phone call. Yeah. And then you transfer to something else, it'll take all that information, record all that information, and if anything happens in the mix of that information, you can go in and troubleshoot it in real time. Moving on to number three, and this is actually one of my personal favorites because uh, for those of you watching the video, you may or may not know, I'll tag it above on YouTube. We actually did a couple of really good demos on this. Coming in at number three is Ring Sense. This is my favorite, but I'm gonna let you take it away. What is it, what does it do, and why do people want it where the shoe fits? Ring Sense is, is common sense. Ring Sense is having the best answer with the best information in real time. Ring Central is AI. Welcome to the AI ages, right? This is where we're at. Um, we've been on the front end of that for a while. Some of our competitors out there have absolutely done a fantastic job in the AI market space, and we utilize that technology all from the behemoths that are out there that everyone's aware of. The Googles, the Amazons, the Microsofts, believe it or not, the Walmart, right? We're talking about massive communication, whether if you guys remember when we'd all, you get that calling card from Walmart, right? Yeah. You were, you were calling in for that card. You were putting in money to that card. They were collecting information. And with that information, they were taking utterances of communication and they were mashing that up and be able to promote what we call AI today to give you the best answer. And so training was no longer as essential. The AI did it for you. Now, now the question is just for the layman watching this. So if I'm understanding what you're saying, Ring Sense is essentially listening what people are saying, monitoring, and it's collecting data for the business to be able to utilize for analytics or, or what in the general sense is it doing? Well, first of all, you're hired because you are a good <laughs> listener. So I nailed it. <laughs> Secondly, you're right. I mean, go ahead. Yeah, simply put, Ring Sense is a tool that allows uh, your calls to be able to be recorded and analyzed through the AI. Yep. And it'll do different things in the call. So you can do real-time coaching of your salespeople. So imagine you're on the phone and uh, Ring Sense is going in your phone call. And all of a sudden it's saying, you know, you're saying this certain phrase over and over. Maybe it's something you don't want to say too much. Or say the customer sounds a little upset here. Sentiment analysis. So that's, you know, you know, maybe I should work on trying to fix their problems so they sound a little happier. Uh, it's analyzing the phone call. It's doing all these different things that you can do. And then taking that data if you want and exporting it to a different platform you're using, such as Salesforce. Okay. You know, he said one thing that always resonates in my mind. We talk about those escalation calls, and there's always a lot of them. People are passionate about whatever they were passionate about. Yeah. Made them give a phone call in. And sometimes you just don't have the right answer. And a lot of people try to ad lib that information and it ends up getting them in quicksand. And the more the talk, the further down they go, and pretty soon they bury themselves. Yeah. And the customer never comes back. That's where AI is going to jump in and help you. It's going to give you the best answer based off of statistical information so you don't ever have have to feel uncomfortable that you're not giving good information. Gotcha. All right, let's move on to number four. And this one is actually new to me, so I'm gonna let you guys take it away on this one. Number four out of the top five Ring Central business features for 2024 is Ring Central events. What is it? What does it do? And how do businesses benefit from this? I love events. Events is a company we acquired. The company uh, was called Hoppin. Um, they had done an amazing job with their product. Imagine just a beautiful, um, sales kickoff or a town hall, but it turns into Hollywood. You have these big screens and everything's very clear and it looks very professional. This events platform has built a software around it so we could just be sitting in, in something like this in a big ballroom and you would never know we can make this look like, you know, we're on a Hollywood stage. Huh. And you know, everything that comes to life and it brings everything to the forma. You want to market the same time, like Prince is going to put this out and he's going to have a lot of stuff behind it. We hope he's using our product because if he is, he's going to find that his life and, and the people that are editing just became a lot easier. Yeah. So uh, I'm, I'm pretty sure he's going to ask me for a license after this. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Coming in at number five, the final one for the top five Ring Central business features in 2024. And I actually see it on the banner that you've got back there is Ring CX. 
What is it? What does it do? And how do businesses benefit from Ring Central's Ring CX? Man, y'all, this this is my passion. This is this is where I've lived for many, many, many years. Too many to admit. I love Contact Center. I love everything about Contact Center. Our CCAS or Contact Center platform is offering the best of AI. It's offering the best in voice activated dialing. We're, we're offering things in um, an IVR that people have not seen in our studio that are just unbelievable. Skills-based routing is so, so important. I have so much stuff in my brain, I'm just like freaking out right now when you're asking me this question. It's, it's crazy. But the number one thing that I really love about this product is we have this very powerful dialer. And this dialer is this progressive preview and predictive dialing. If you don't know what that means, look it up and there's a difference between all of them and how it will benefit your business. This is just getting communication out to your customers. This is getting communication in from your customers. This is emergency notifications. It's all over the board, but more importantly, it's all encompassed in one platform. So we have our EX, which is our just UCAS or our telephone system that connects into our CX which gives you all the things that I just talked about, including the skills-based routing, and you're able to use a single line of telephony because we cover that in too, so you're not paying exorbitant telco costs for this scenario. A lot of companies out there, they got this on one side, a partner over here does this over here, and pretty soon, all these different legs add up to two cents a minute on each leg. So a normal call for 10 minutes at two cents a minute with Ring Central, 20 cents. If you were using three or four technologies, it could be 60 cents, 80 cents a minute. Yeah. That becomes a big, big deal. I love Ring CX. It's an absolutely awesome platform. It's powerful and it's affordable. If you think about every single company now, you know, think about your company. Um, you want to be able to engage with your customers in the best way. Think about it. when you go to return something on, say, Amazon, right? Yep. You can chat with them. You can call them. You can text them. You can do any other any way to communicate with them. And Ring CX opens that up for every company out there. Traditionally, content center platforms have been fairly expensive. Yeah. And while everyone needs these tools, sometimes it wasn't available for, say, the small business, medium business. But Ring CX has changed that. It's totally changed the game. It really is powerful and affordable. And uh, that's not to say it's not being used by huge companies either, because it is. It's got the capabilities, you know, that you need, but it's for everybody. And I love it. You reminded me, this digital side of things, the guys, I mean, this is where the world is going. If you're 40 years in, and younger, uh -huh. we're not traditionally talking on the phone as much as we used to. We want answers very quickly, and we're doing it through all of our social channels. And I don't want to do it through LinkedIn because I don't like LinkedIn, or I don't want to do it on Facebook because I don't want, we don't care. We got 20 plus channels that we're working with digitally to bring in this information. Yeah. And again, that cradle to grave, we're bringing that information in maybe off of a simple text or a chat or a tweet or whatever it is. And we're turning it into a video and we're solving problems. And then we're handing the package back to you to analyze and go, what went well with that call? What didn't go well with that call? What could I have done better in that call? Yeah. Along with jumping in and actually helping you do better with the call in real time. That's kind of an overarching theme with Ring Central. It's like our solution has always been so feature rich and thought out that we don't force you to work in a certain way. We know that different groups and different companies want to work the way they want to work. You want to work with right. the platforms you use. You want to work the way that suits your company. So we're not going to make you do it our way. We're going to yeah. say, here's a large solution that you can pull from easily and quite easily. And here's what you can do with it. Go for it. You know? Yeah. Make it work for you. All right. Cool. Well, I appreciate all the insight today, guys. And definitely, I want to personally thank you. Yeah. Um, I want to thank you and also thank you for being here to speak with my viewers. And I hope you have a really great rest of your show. Before we wrap this video up, for those of you who are watching, you know the drill. If you like anything that you've heard today, any of these features, or you just want to find out about the other features that Ring Central has, there's many. Let me know. Our information is below the video. You can contact us and we'll not only hook you up with our contacts at Ring Central for a quote, special pricing, demo to see what makes sense for you, but they'll work directly with you to see if the solution makes sense and all that good stuff. As always, this is Prince Rich with Rich Technology Group, your go-to guy for the best deals on business phone and internet service in the United States. I'll catch you guys again in the next video. Y'all come back now, you hear? <laughs>